What is going on, guys, and welcome back to another episode of our MLB The Show 21 Road to the Show series with our two-way player, Everett Scott. I almost forgot what number uh, this game was, but it is 21. But uh, we'll forget about that. That's not important. Um, Today, we will be doing one game. I don't know if I explained it in the previous episode. Um, We pitched this game here. This was our first uh, home game since being called up to the majors, and unfortunately, we lost. We only gave up ru- uh, one run, and then the pitcher that came in to relieve us, or another, or a couple pitchers, I don't know, uh, gave up three more. Um, so I don't really think I should have been credited with the loss, but I don't know how that gets determined. But we will be playing the Cincinnati Reds once again in today's episode. Um, this time we will be on their home turf, so we will see if we can uh, get a win there and get some uh, revenge for this loss here. Um, I do apologize that there is not a Grand Theft Auto video, but I do believe I did say that in the previous episode, I believe I said that um, there probably wouldn't be one this Saturday, which is when you'll see this video. Um but I do promise that there will be one next Saturday. Um, but you guys are loving the MLB series. I'm loving playing it, so I don't I don't have a problem with it. Um, I did get a request from Yosemite Dan um, to show off my loadout progression. Um, yeah, I think this is what he meant. I would assume. But yeah, he wanted to just, he wanted me to show it off, so, to see where we're at here. I don't play Diamond Dynasty. Um, Maybe I will, since it says you can play it against a CPU. Maybe I'll do that. Might have to. I didn't know you could play against computer in Diamond Dynasty. I always thought it was just an online thing, and I hate online stuff, but... This is currently where we're at with our Road to the Show stuff. I don't know if these like reset once you finish all of them or or what, or if they give you completely new ones. Um, but we're uh, over the halfway mark for strikeouts, 80 strikeouts. We got 40 of them. We got one, obviously. Uh, tally eight strikeouts in Road to the Show. That must reset or something. Oh, it's repeatable. Duh. Should have looked at that. So I guess the ones that are repeatable just continuously restart. Um, But like, what about these ones? That's what I'm not sure about. But anyway, um, hopefully that is what you wanted to see. Uh, Dan, uh, I blanked on your name. I do apologize. Um, So we're close. We are close to getting to, uh, I believe... Yeah, that'll give us our silvers for our main loadout. So that'll really boost our overall a little bit. Um, So yeah, and then we can check out the hitter one as well. I don't think we're doing so well or so hot on this one. Yeah, we're really far back on this one. Excuse me. I feel like I'm getting sick, so I do apologize if if I clear my throat a lot in this video, but... Yeah, you can definitely tell that we're, we've been uh, performing better as a pitcher. So, but yeah, um, hopefully that is what you wanted to see there, Dan. Um, if not, just uh, I'll hopefully be able to show it to you next time. And I will, he asked if I could show that every few games. So I will try and get into the habit of doing it. I always do intend to do it because I know I should. But like I told Dan in the comments, uh, I just, I forget by the time I get to the end of the video. So um, from now on, every couple episodes of this series or whatever, I will try and show you my progression in the loadouts. Um, Whoops, sorry, I hit the mic there. But yeah, so I think that will wrap it up for kind of the uh, normal intro jargon or whatever. So we will jump into this game here against the Cincinnati Reds and hopefully we can actually get our first major league win. All right, so our first, our first opportunity on the mound here in this game here. Got a little confused at what I was trying to say there. Ah, is that fair? It must be. Nice play by our third baseman, though. I'm not going to blame him, but we might have him at two. 
No, just got in there. Nice play, though, by the outfielders. So we give up a double right off the first pitch. I'm not worried about it. We'll get him. Or we'll get the three outs. Wearing our 1980, 1982 road unis. I was going to switch it to my own choice, but this is what it had automatically picked. So I'm just going to roll with it. I think they look pretty snazzy. And that should be an out at first, but he does advance to third. So we will have to keep an eye on that. Maybe get the force out at home if he goes. Eugenio Suarez. All right. Try four seamer low on Eugenio. Hopefully, I'm pronouncing that right. Curveball. Early release, though. Way outside. All right. Going to go with the four seamer inside low corner. See if we can get him here. All right. Fouls that off to the side. Oh, my cat's outside saying hello. Got him whiffing on the curve. Try another curve ball. See if we can get him to do the same thing. Early release. Ah, just outside. It's a full count, though. All right, fouls that back. Try a change up here. Oh, so we're going to give up the run early, but we will get the out at first. All right, well, unfortunately, we give up another early run, just like in the previous episode. I apologize for my cat freaking out, but we do give up a run early, just like in the previous episode, but we will be all right. Mike Moustak is coming up to bat, though. Doesn't bite on it. Going to go with the four-seamer low now. Oh, absolutely crushes that, but our left fielder should have it. And it's apparently Wilson Contreras. I didn't know he was a left fielder also. But that'll do it for the top of the first. Or bottom of the first, I guess. My bad. All right, so our first batting opportunity, we tied it up. We got a runner on first with two outs here. See what we can do. Good eye there. I've been watching too much uh, Bobby Crosby. You guys, if you're watching this, you've probably definitely watched Bobby Crosby. He always says good eye, at least in the start of his series, his Bobby Crosby series. Oh, that was a nice pitch. I was way too late on that. All right, come on. There you go. I thought it might drop, so I was waiting for it, but it didn't. Come on, Luis. Is it Luis or Lewis? Probably Luis. Just going off of the last name of Castillo, I would assume it's Luis. But I could be wrong. It might be Lewis. That's a strike, but I didn't want to go. He's safe. Maybe I should have swung on it, but we'll be all right. There you go. Low, full count. So he'll be moving to third, I think. Oh, got me whiffing. Good pitch. All right, so as you saw in the last, uh, well... Not last inning, but just a few seconds ago when Scott was up to bat, we did tie it. I don't know why that was so difficult for me to say, but we start off the bottom of the second with a nice strike there. Uh, I guess we'll retire the side in order because that's the only choice we have. Let's try another four-seamer low, maybe get him to ground out. Got him to foul it. I definitely got to up my uh, Ks per nine because I don't get a lot of strikeouts. I just get like... Uh, ground outs or fly outs most of the time all right go with a four seamer low now 
crushed it foul. All right, going with the fork ball. First appearance of the fork ball in this game. See if we can get him whiffing. There we go. Fork ball coming in clutch there. First strike out of the game. All right, going to go with the change up low to start off Nicholas Castellanos. Uh, just outside. All right, try fastball now, right in like his only blue zone. Oh, fouled off. Nice souvenir for a fan. They didn't really seem to care, apparently. They just sat there. I'd be diving for the ball. Another four-seamer. Fouled it off again. Maybe we should go with the fork ball. No, he wants the, he wants the four-seamer. Oh, little golf shot. I have that, though, for the second out. All right. Matt Adams up to bat now. Get him with a four-seamer low. Didn't bite on it. All right, another four-seamer. Oh, that'll be a fly out. And there we go. All right, bottom of the third now. Still tied at one. But we're, I guess we'd technically be off to a better start than we were in the last game. But maybe I spoke too soon as we give up that hit right up the middle. But considering we actually managed to score while I'm still pitching is a lot better than our previous outing, in my opinion. I should have probably tried to move towards it, but... I figured my guys had it. But we're facing the pitcher now. He's bunting. Oh, it goes foul. He'll probably try and bunt again. Yep. Wow, he's safe. So still we have potential double play opportunity, but we got to be careful with that. If the guy advances to third. All right. Another four seamer. That'll go foul. Change up low inside corner. See if we can get him with him. No, gets a piece of it. Now he wants me to go four-seamer low in the zone. Crushes it, but Contreras has it, and they will all return to their bases. So now a double play opportunity would be ideal to get us out of this one quickly. Um, and the inning without throwing a wild pitch or allowing a run? I guess I will... I guess I'll do this one. Get my control up. And I've never thrown a wild pitch. But now that I just said that and selected the challenge, I will throw one. That'll be right to the right fielder. And they will stay on their bases. I don't know why I took so much time to say that. Eugenio, Jesus, I was way off. I do apologize. Thank you, Ump. I appreciate the call. All right, curveball low. I think the curveball is what uh, screwed us over when we gave up that run early in the first. There we go. That's going to drop. And that'll be another run. And they will stay. All right. Well, there goes the challenge. All right. Definitely can tell I'm in the majors. There we go. 
buddy is high-fiving teammates in the dugout. He's got a chance to Another four-seamer low. Thank you, Ump. Thanks for calling that in my favor. Same spot. Fouled it off. Change up low. Just managed to get a piece of it. We went low. I'm going to go four-seamer up high. Ah, got a piece of it. This guy's putting up a fight. Got to give him credit. A little golf shot there, or a little chip shot, I guess. But we get the final out. We all, we gave up a run, unfortunately, but we can get it back. All right, bottom of the fourth, still trailing by one. Let's have a quick out here so we can uh, boost our team's confidence and tie this game and potentially take the lead. All right. Fastball low inside. That'll go right to the second baseman. But he gets the out at first. Good play. Nick Castellanos. Curveball. Low. Got him with him, thankfully. Going for another curve. Still low in the zone. Oh. Good job, Nick. I'll give you credit. I would have whiffed on it. And that'll go right over the third baseman. Did someone seriously just shout, go home, go home? Dude, he's not getting inside the park homer off that. But we give up another hit. As long as it doesn't turn into a run. And try and set up a double play. Hopefully he can get that, and he does. That'll work too. Lucky plays like that. All right, this is the guy that got the first hit off me. There we go. At least I believe this is the guy who got the first hit of the game off me. Or no, it was the first guy because I gave up a double on my first pitch. So I don't know what the hell I was talking about. There we go. Got him whiffing. That'll end the fourth. All right. Scott up to bat now. No one on, one out. There you go. Low. I ain't swinging. Ah, oh, come on, go, 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 go. Thank you. Just above the zone, thankfully. There we go. Three and one. Oh, there we go. Come on. No. Ah, that was such a good, like, feeling when it came off the bat, and it was just a fly out. All right, but we're back to the pitcher now. Hopefully we can get him out. Just another four-seamer low. Got a piece of it, and he'll get a nice shot up the middle through the gap. What are they doing out there? Get him, get him, get him. Oh, my God. I gave up a triple to the fucking pitcher. I'm not blaming myself on that, though. What the fuck were they doing out in fucking center field? It looked like they were just bobbling around with the ball. Yeah, what the hell was that, Ian Happ? What the fuck is he doing? God. 
I don't blame that on me. Ian Happ was just an idiot there for some reason. He like stumbled. Hopefully we don't let... Oh, there you go. Nice job, Brennan Drury. Or no, he's the first baseman. Who's on third? I get so confused. I need to learn my team. If this was like current rosters, I'd know it fairly decent. So we could still get a double play. All right, not with that. He's going to come in to score. Unless we can gun him. We can gun him. Come on. Oh, my God. I can't believe I gave up a run to the fucking pitcher. Anyway, just move on. We still have plenty of the game left, even though I'll probably get pulled after this one. All right, well, I'll definitely get pulled after this inning now that I gave up two runs. And the ump's a fucking piece of shit calling that. Well, we're, we'll definitely lose because we're not going to get three runs. So I'm going to get credited with my third loss. Or second loss, excuse me. Oh, thank God. He actually has that. Let's see if we actually play anymore or if we get pulled. Yeah, so we got pulled and we lost. I kind of expected that, though. Yep, so I get credited with the loss. At least this one I do feel I deserved. Um, I feel like I should be 0-1 uh, and one still, not 0-2. and two, But... Uh, it's whatever, I guess. We're we're still we're still new to the majors, I guess. So we'll get better, though. It's just kind of frustrating when you when you're struggling at first, um, especially when I was starting to actually pitch pretty well. But like I said, we'll get better. We just have to up our attributes a little bit more, and I actually have to play some on my own time. Um, but no, we'll actually get pretty. We'll get. We'll get pretty good. I know we will. It'll just take a. It'll just take a uh, little bit of time. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna end it here. So hopefully you guys still uh, found some enjoyment out of this video, even though it was kind of frustrating. Um, probably not just for me either. It probably was frustrating for you guys to watch. But nevertheless, hopefully you did find something to enjoy in this episode. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you have not done so already. I greatly appreciate it if you did those things. Also, make sure to leave me some feedback or leave me a comment telling me what you thought about the video. I guess that's literally the same thing. Um, but you guys know what to do. You guys are, you guys are great. So uh, yeah, so that'll wrap it up for this one, guys. So until next time, take care.